guys. Uh, welcome to the opening of my new cafe and gallery, Toast. You can also buy my merch there as well. It's a good opening. I'll put a post up on our space. Uh, of course, it immediately got deleted for hate speech, but then I put another one up, and I'm, I'm quite pleased with the turnout. And may I park up because I'd better do an opening speech. Oh, Bobby, I just had the weirdest dream. <laughs> Look where I am. Can you tell where I am yet? Let's pull over here a minute. Oh, hello peeps and welcome to one of my wrong think videos. I don't know if you can tell, but I am here at what is called the British Museum. It's topical, you know, it's topical because it's been in the news, because inside there, but perhaps not for much longer, are the Elgin Marbles. Now, because I know people in low places, I have something to show you. Where is it? <laughs> there it is. You're going to love this. They have given me just a little sample of them to show you, right? That is your actual Elgin marbles. So they tell me. I've got to return them though. I'm talking of returning marbles. Well, if you stay right to the end, I'm going to try and give you a potted history of the Elgin Marbles if you're interested. And I'm actually going to try and get in there, as I think you can, and have a look at them before they go. In the meantime, this is a wrong thing video. Pull over right now. There you go. Hey! Pull that over! What? Pull that off the road! What? Pull that thing off the road! Bus that was a bus canyon. I don't believe it. Well, everybody likes one. Now, they don't want to go in their little cycling bloody lane, do they? No, that's too good for their highnesses. Are they going to cut me off? Oh, what? Now they pretend to go in the back of that little car. <laughs> I can see why cyclists are so much loved. They're treasured, you know, in the UK. What's this fucker doing? And the fucking Mazda. The Mazda without the indicator lights. Perhaps he's going straight on. You're going for the hedge, mate. Where the fuck are oh, you going? Look at it, look at it. No fucking clue. Look at it. BMW, funny isn't it BMW, it's always want to be in your lane. <laughs> He's not indicating, but he is a BMW. <laughs> I had a feeling, I just sensed, oh it's a woman, I just sensed that uh, she wanted to go in there. Oh well, bless their hearts. <laughs> and look where I am. Well, I'm taxed as a bloody bicycle. Get over it. <laughs> yeah. And I'm a webble. You can imagine all the cyclists get, oh, you're, you're in our special box. All the bloody cyclists say that. Oh, yes, you're in our special box. See, when a cyclist gets home, he goes onto YouTube and starts watching videos and uh, keyboards ready. In fact, they've worn out the keys that spell, you're in our special box. And this, this black cab would trigger it. And look at me, look at me, see? Right in your special box. Fucking cyclist. Found his indicator. Marvellous. No, that bloody mini cab. No indicator. He got it. I love your dog. <laughs> it's not a dog. It's a dead cat. <laughs> you 
you know, in, you know the um, massage feet warmer, what? the massage feet warmer kit. Yeah. You should have shouldn't have got that. You should have got the indicator pack. What's an indicator pack? Well, they've got these flashing lights on the corners of the car yeah, and you, you can get a pack for that so you can tell other road users where you're going. Sorry, yeah. Sorry about that. No, that's okay. That's okay. Sorry. Better than a seat warmer. She's going now. She's not looking. She's not looking. No. She's not looking. What's that? A toaster? You got a toaster there, dear? Yeah, you. Is that a toaster? I think you got a toaster. I love toast. She's hanging on to it really tight, so it's going to be a struggle, isn't it? Probably a bit unseemly if I try and take it off her. No, better not. It was a toaster though, wasn't it? You've got to watch your filter, mate. You go first. There you go. <laughs> it's a bit much, isn't it, when you learn all the timings of the lights and everything. Oh! Well, he was on the crossing, mate. <laughs> oh, arms folded running, one of my favourites. <laughs> now, only, I know I'm going to be sexist again, but only women do arms folded running. Why is that? Why is that? Because if they stumble, they fall flat on their face. Are we going to see arms folded crossing? I think we are. Go on, get to the front. Yep, go on, girl. Arms folded crossing coming up. She knows. She's trained for this all her life. This is a big day. She don't want to be too close to me, though. She knows I'm a bit weird. In there to uh, record the event for the Guinness Book of Records. Here we go, arms folded crossing, brilliant, brilliant. Well done, she's halfway now, she's halfway, she's going to the front, she's going to the front there, and she's made it, arms folded crossing, what a brilliant display there. I think that was one of the best examples I've seen this minute. That looks like a challenge on, the, on his pack there, doesn't it? Gorillas, faster than you. Hang on. that so I can't get down. Fucking idiot. He's not faster than me. That was a bloody lie. I bet you he's following me. No, he isn't. <gasps> and I'm at the front where I belong. <laughs> Yet again, it paid to ride like fucking Mary Poppins, didn't it? I, did, I didn't see any speed guns there, but uh, perhaps they were just too busy to pull me over. They'd already got two vehicles in the web of death. I can get on with it now. Well, people, you got this far. Thank you ever so much for staying this far. The majority of people won't get this far, so you've done really well. Um, so I'm going to say goodbye, unless you want to watch me try and go and see the Elgin Marbles. I'll have to go and park this somewhere. And uh, otherwise, maybe you'll come back and watch another one of my videos. And if you are going now, I'll say cheerio then. Okay, cheerio. Take care now, all right? And thank you. Bye, bye, bye. Right, let's go and try and park. Now, now, here's my potted history of the Elgin Marbles. So forgive me if they get the details wrong. Um, the Elgin Marbles are called the Elgin Marbles after a bloke called Elgin, a British sort of collector. 
So he went over to Greece and he came across the Elgin marbles and he wanted to bring them back to England because they were, they were getting shot at. At the time, uh, Greece was under the control of the Ottoman Empire. Now, they weren't big on fighting and what they were big on was actually making furniture. You've probably heard of the Ottoman. Uh, anyway, they had a problem, the Ottoman Empire, with uh, French people occupying Egypt. And they said to Elgin, well, you can have the marbles if your country can clear out the uh, cheese-eating surrender monkeys from Egypt, which we did. Uh, the British did that, and we got the Elgin marbles, or he did. Uh, they, they were his property. Now, Elgin fell on a bit of hard times financially. He lived in Park Lane, as you know, a very rough area, and he kept some of the uh, marbles in his um, home because he didn't have, have room for storage and all that, and he fell on hard times, and he, he wanted to sell the marbles, and he was asking over 70 grand for them in that time, and there were no offers. Uh, of course, you know, they're all broken. And anyway, they, uh, in the end, he managed to flog them to the British Parliament. Uh, but they only gave him about 35 grand for them. Uh, better than nothing, I suppose, because they are all broken, as you know. And a lot of the statues don't have heads on. And if you're wondering why, well, the reason for that is because the Greeks, they couldn't, not for a long time, they could never do heads. So they just left the heads off. Anyway, that is the uh, potted history of um, the Elgin marbles, and they may go back to Greek. I don't know who should have them, I'm not saying. Um, but if you are a tourist and it's raining and you want something free to do, come to the British Museum because I found the staff really, really friendly and it's free. It's huge, there is so much to see. A lot of it's old stuff though. So there, thank you ever so much for getting this far and watching my video. Whatever you're gonna find on this channel next, I don't know. Oh, is he doing duck clips? I don't know he's doing duck clips. No, he wasn't doing duck clips. No. <laughs> he didn't do duck clips.